It's the drug that is being called a game changer in the opioid epidemic, yet there are just a few dozen doctors in the metro who can actually prescribe it. I met a recovering heroin addict who says this medicine has changed his life. That the life that we once lived, we live no longer. Before breakthrough we ministries. In we live in faith in Christ Jesus. Many it's here worshiped no at the altar of drugs. Prior to me coming to know Jesus, amen, I ran the streets. I did wrong, I hustled, I abused narcotics and drugs and women. For aspiring well, minister came, Mark Butler, Christ, it was heroin. Now I'm able over here to preach, teach, and testify. From the Gospel the of John, Lazarus. Christ. It was a move of God's presence and spirit actually raising someone from the dead. But Mark's sharing a resurrection story of his own. Life and death decision. He credits and God. Individual eight milligram. And this little pill, Suboxone. Suboxone. If I would have continued drinking and drugging, they would have probably been burying me in two or three years. After overdosing six times. Narcan yeah. saved my life. Yeah, Narcan saved my life. He found Truman Medical Center's Recovery Health Services, where they treat the disease of addiction. It's kind of like someone with diabetes. If they come in and they need insulin, uh, you, you a doctor would give them insulin, clearly. Suboxone eases painful withdrawal symptoms. On the market for 15 years, it contains Narcan to discourage abuse. Just 38 doctors in Jackson, Clay, and Platte counties have the extra training to prescribe it. We have sorely needed for a long time. Dr. Doug Burgess um, among we, them. If we can get more people prescribing this and increase the access that patients have to this treatment, I think it's absolutely a game changer. Combined with mental health treatment, the effect is immediate. It doesn't take months and years. I mean, people st with the medication, they start to feel better within a few days. It's over. It's over. With. And, uh, let us pray. It's helping Mark find faith in himself, too. It helps me to fulfill what I believe I'm called and created to do. Can I get a witness? Amen. Amy Harrison, so KNBC no 9 News. Ever deny. Some patients will gradually step down their dose until they no longer need that drug. Others may stay on Suboxone for life. Most insurance covers the treatment. Government studies show medication-assisted treatment can help opioid users stay in recovery long term.